Uh, hello, uh, my name is Ntwakhasiso and I'm an electrical engineering student at Central University of Technology and this is my design project. It's called Automatic Pet Feeder. This, this page here, it has a problem statement which identifies the reason why I'm making this project and the description of the whole project that describes how the project works. On this page, it's a block diagram which indicates the input and the output of the of the project and the part that are shaded in red are the one that I have added on top of the existing project. This here is a circuit on a breadboard with every component that I'm going to use. On this part it is schematic with the ones that are in circle are the ones that I have added like I have already explained. And here is a PCB how I'm going to connect the whole circuit uh, this is the flowchart which explains the process of the whole circuit we normally have start then after start we initialize our input and the output then the lcd the lcd will display mess from the container automatically then we'll have ultrasonic sensor which senses the distance in the room if the distance is below 30 meters the servo motor will rotate and and open the container to pour out the food for the pet. And after it has done, it goes back to sense the, the distance again. If not, if not, it go back to ultrasonic sensor to sense the distance. The loops goes on and on. And then this side we have LDR, which senses the light in the house. If the, the light is below 75, if the light is below 75, the, the relay module will trigger and switches off, off and on the LEDs, which is our output from the LDR. And after it has done that, it will go back to senses the light again. If the light is not below 75, it goes back to the LDR to senses the light and the loops goes on and on. And here we have, here we have, load cell and HX711 amplifier which senses the mass. If the mass is below a certain gram, the LCD will display a message for the pet owner and the buzzer will, will go on to alert the owners to refill the container and after that it go it comes back to senses the mass again. If not, if not it goes back to senses the weight until it has a weight below a certain gram and the loops goes on and on. Uh, now we come to the to the project. Uh, there is a ultrasonic sensor here which will sense the, the distance and it will tell the servo motor over here and the servo motor will rotate and open the container and it will pour out the food here. And our LCD will display mass and a message for the owner. Here is our LDR, will sense the light, and this relay inside will trigger. One of the LEDs will be on, and they will keep switching on and off. There is a there is a HX711 inside here, which will take the information from the load cell here. The load cell will sense the mass from this container so now i will load the code and see if that will actually happen and it has a delay to avoid pouring out all the food in the container at the same time Now, now we're gonna come to our LDR and see if the LEDs will switch. So this means that when it's when it's dark or it's sunset, the LDR will sense the light and the 
the relay will trigger the LEDs and the LEDs will switch off. Now let's come to our LCD. Our LCD that has play, displayed a mess in the container. So here's all to 